Hey, this is Nick Nelson, Mad Scientist of Muscle, and what I've got for you today here is a metabolic monster done using heavy kettlebell swings as the intermediary exercise. What you're going to be doing is first a set of heavy kettlebell swings. I've got a 125 pound dumbbell set up with my kettle stack, um, sorry, kettle clamp kettlebell handles. Now, if you have a regular kettlebell, that's perfect. If you just have dumbbells, you can actually do dumbbell swings as well by holding underneath the top set of uh, plates with the dumbbell standing vertically. So, set of swings, and then immediately a set of push-ups, as many push-ups as you can get. Then immediately more swings, and then straight to chin-ups, as many chin-ups as you can get. Um, if you can't do chin-ups, not a problem, you can always go to inverted rows. That's um, just as, as good. Set the bar to about uh, anywhere between stomach to chest height, and you're going to be pulling yourself up like a body weight row. So once you've done those, straight back to the heavy kettlebell swings, and then you're going to be doing a heavy kettlebell slash dumbbell squat. Now, the trick with this one here is you actually want to make this as hard as possible for your legs. So you're going to be getting down, either if you're doing a dumbbell squat, grip under the top set of plates. What I want you to do here is actually set your feet fairly wide, pull yourself down into the squat so you're getting your butt down as far as possible. So you're making this as far as, as hard as possible. Your arms are going to be bent as you start the exercise, then you stand up and you can let your arms go straight. But basically the idea is to load your legs in as deep of squat as possible. So that way you don't need a whole lot of weight, but you're getting massive range of motion. So then you're going to finish with another set of kettlebell swings.
Right, so in terms of reps, we're looking at about 10 reps for the heavy kettlebell swings, um, high reps for the push-ups, uh, preferably 15 to 20 reps. And uh, for the chin-ups, basically as many as you can get, 5 to 10 reps or so is good. Um, and for the squats, um, again, 5 to 10 reps, going very, very far down, as far down as you can go, really feeling that hitting the quads extremely hard. So give that circuit a try. It's a great metabolic monster. Uh, I finished this four or five minutes ago, and I'm already still huffing and puffing. So. Give this one a shot, work all the major muscle groups in your entire body. I think you're gonna like it.